What is up, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Hogwarts Legacy. Let's, we're trying to take go back and get that book that that dude needs us, so let's just see where we're going. Oh, oh, oh that's right. Uh, I figured this out. If I can remember, which one is this one right here? Let's do. Uh, Oops. Oh, well. I feel kind of bad. <laughs> Anything else? No. Oh, what do you think this is? Wonder if I can light those. Woo! Not entirely sure I was supposed to do that. Oh. Oh, where'd you go? There we go. All right. Let's see what I've got. My slots are full. <gasps> this is what we've been waiting on. Is there a way to mark that chest? Or oh, did they mark it for me? Nice. It's over here. This way. What's this? And a key. A key. All right. It's like they don't want me running around exploring. <laughs> ah! Hello? Hmm. Who's this guy? Sleeping Dragon Statue. Draco Dormian's Nunquam's Terrible. Never tickle a sleeping dragon. Good advice. All right, let's see here. Ooh. Urn of Ashes. Remember to have once more an inscription pioneer and dragon taming. Should not have started with Hungarian Hortel. Hmm. Hmm. Open? Nope. Oh. I should have paid attention to exactly where I'm at. What's up here? Oh look. It's 
It's one of these things. Um. Oh, no. It was uh, Lumos. Right. Uh, I'm not sure I've seen that before. Hmm. All right. Let's go get. Let's go get my broom. Well, right here, let's just take this one. Broken broom. Celine Wharton Abbey. The all the remains after she insisted on demonstrating her experimental lunar apparition charm. Oh. Huh. Or a girl. My slots is full. What's going on here? <laughs> oh, sir. Wow. <laughs> didn't quite make that one, did you? All right, let's get the show on the road. <laughs> Hello. What the hell's the seat? Sorry, can't hear you. All right. Move in a direction. Can I go faster? Let's go. There we are. Wee. Da na na. Be like it. Universal. <laughs> All kinds of stuff to explore out here. Big ass chest.
Você vai. Bam. <laughs> Easy. <laughs> Who is this asshole? <laughs> Named after. <laughs> Sounds like Eric Clapton. <laughs> Okay. The Allery been up there. Oh, man. Oh, oh man. How's he so fast? So can I just go over here? So can I just grab one of these brooms anytime I want, or what's up? Spent witches. Hmm. Nice. All right. Well, I say we go to spent witches. It's uh. Let's go. Son of a...
Y'all done? Alright, let's, uh, let me see something. Oh, yeah, we got talent points. I forgot. One talent point available. I can't do any of those. 16, I'm not there. Stealth. Alright, let's see. Um, hmm. oh. Let's go get rid of some of this stuff. I can get a broom. Map. Map. Hog me. Where am I supposed to go? Alright, let's see here. Quest log. One assignment. Alright, let's look on the map. Right here we are. Open up. I wonder if he'll buy my stuff. Buy the stuff I have so I can see. Aha, yes. Sell. So, 3,000. Hmm. Dang. Yeah, but I don't really want. Sure, it's gonna probably come to bite me later on, but I wish it was just like a place I could just put this stuff, you know. Alright, let's see what you got. Dang it. You have a speedy broom with a unique one. Oh, well, hell, they're all. Oh look, that's got a little, that's got a light and all kinds of stuff. I'm gonna go with this one. Nice.
Well, yes, I am. Okay. How about free since I'm checking it out? Quidditch pitch. Alright, so how do I, uh, I thought I saw him. I thought I saw a, a Merlin thing. What is this? Huh. Maybe I didn't. Hmm. Maybe I didn't. Alright, so. No? Where in the hell is my broom? Uh, LB and. Well, that didn't work. Nice. Woohoo! All peaceful. Let me find some more um, those Merlin things. Hello. Oh, there's just. Yeah, what up? Hmm. Oh, bitch. Oh, I just noticed she's Slytherin too. Didn't pay attention. <coughs> Mop the floor with your ass. Oh. 
Oh shit! I messed up already. What is this? I missed my bubbles. The bubbles. Hey, what's going on? Where the hell are we? Ah, oh, you suck! Hmm. Well. Hmm. I wonder. It's over there. Huh. Well, Stonehenge or something. A little bitty one. Ah, ha, ha, ha. supposed to do here. Boom. Easy. I'd like to know how many of those there are. Nothing. Let's just see. 
What's going on over here? Hello. Nothing. They're mad at me. Because I whooped their asses. Much nicer. Ah. I'm back. Okay. All right, let's um Hi, Kitty. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're a cool looking cat. Camera. Okay, let's um Where's my outpost? What this guy? Where is he? Where is he? This one. J. Pippin's potions. Let's see. J. Pippin's potions. No. There we are. See what he wants. Since I'm here, might as well. Maybe I can get some stuff. Bam! Oh, yeah. Let me see what he's got. I might as well. Good God, why? Hey, do you have any, uh, any mallow? Where do I get those? Hmm. <coughs> Make better shit.
Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Oh, hang on. I'm going to go ahead and try and find some, uh, what do you think of me? Maybe the magic neep? Let's turn around. Really? That's it. Okay. Let's find more. Oh, oh. damn, I'm a bit of ways away from her, aren't I? My kitty. Huh. Well, there's something over here. I feel like there was something be something over there. I remember seeing one down here. Yeah, chest down here. Well, look at all this down here. Wow. Oh, I've already been here. Oh, okay, I know where this is. What's around here? <laughs> no, I can't. Please. All right, like I'm far away from him. Hmm. What's going on over there? I need to find all these Merlin things so I can. <laughs> Be cruising awesome with blaster off of this. Good night. We're here. Hello. Yeah, 
because you won't leave his ass alone. Bitch. Exactly. Man, I'm about to just... That's what I don't know where I'm going to get it. Uh, is it an LB? We are looking for, I have a ton of that, let's get some wiggle weed. Oh, damn, I want all kinds of stuff over here. We'll start with this. Damn it! All right, let's see if there's any Merlin things around me. Good Lord, how long far does this go? Damn! It's really. <laughs> I have lost track of where my thing was, first off. I don't want to return to his dumb ass. be honest with you. Oh. There's a Merlin trial right there. Oh shit, what was that? Okay, there's one right here.
be honest with you, I didn't see anything this one did. Hmm. Okay. You went down with this one, Marilyn. What's that? this over here hmm. huh. all right what the hell am I whoa whoa Um, hello? Um, let's just try this. Yeah, we'll come back to that later. <coughs> what that was about. Hmm. Well. One second, I find. What do I have in here? What would you like to buy from me? Let's see. Oh. Ooh. Down twenty seven. Sell that. There we go. Hang on. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, so now Ding. let's uh.
let's just see something here. Another Marlin trial. A bunch of Marlin trials right here. How many of them are there? What you got left? Oh, train tracks. That's what I'm looking for? No. There we go. like three in a row right here so what about these little thingies I can't remember oh all kinds of little things treasure vault what Leopold Babcock let's just do this real quick let's just do one thing at a time here Miss, was the other one? Dang, let's find the other one. One, two. And Ray. <laughs> Easy.
Why don't you worry about that, all right? Leopold. Hmm. I don't know how many I have. Hmm. Ooh, I need some of this right here. Brown. What? I yeah, remember that. Ooh. Five thousand. What do I have here? Oh, we got a bit of ways to go. Remember, he has a broom. What's this? If I can jump over, I can fly over. Oops. All right. Um. There we go. Really? Got a ticket to ride. <laughs> All right, let's um, continue on down the way. That's Leopold. He's got a thing I want. A broom. She got this. Oh, oops. Where's uh? I don't know what I gotta do here. You gotta find the thingy first. I've already done this. Maybe. No. Where's the damn? Hmm. I don't see the little block that goes up there. Interesting. All right. Whoa. Wow. Damn, that reveals like everything. All around.
What's that? There you are. Shit. All right. Image. All right. Nothing over there. Leech juice. Y'all suck. Oh, shit. Woo. They're both dead. What do we have here? Ah. What do you suppose this is? Uh, I bet this has to do with that. Okay. Hmm. 
Hmm. I don't know. One of them worked. I think anyway. Here too. Oh, one over here. What is that? Shit. If you ever try to run up on me like that, man. All right, anywho, let's go back to this. All right, so clearly. in here. Let's try uh Hmm. I doubt it's this. Hmm. Not three of them, is there four? Let's check out our quest. Ghost of our love. Well, let's just do this. Let's see what this asshole wants. Revelio. I'm not paying attention.
Revelio. Sing around. Wait on him. I was more to wait. Over here. Sebastian, it's been a while. <coughs> it has. Glad you received my owl. I have something to show you. First, let me thank you for what you did in the library. Of course. Scribner tried to give me detention, but I have ways out of these things. Well, you took the fall for me, and that counts for something. Did you find what you were looking for? I did, but something was missing. I'm not sure here is the best place to discuss it. Understood. We can talk more in a moment, in the Undercroft. Not even the, the professors Undercroft. know about this place. Oh, really? This way. There's a secret passage just here. It's well disguised. Hmm. Okay. Well, how in the hell did I know that? How did you find this place? My friend, Ominous Gaunt. Revelio. We used to play gobstones here all the time. With my sister, Anne. She loved that infernal game. What I wouldn't give to lose to her again. I should tell you, I swore to Ominous I would safeguard this place. So please, keep I find it that. Us. He never confides in anyone. But he's trusted me since the day we met. I wouldn't want to jeopardize that. We used to sneak in here almost Rebellion. daily. We've never been caught. I know Ominous. Met him in our common room. I've noticed he uses his wand to navigate the castle. He does. No idea how, though. Ominous was born blind and no spell could reverse it. His wand seems almost sentient. Not surprising, I suppose. Ollivander always says, the wand chooses the wizard. Is that how he found this place? No, someone in his family knew about it. The Gaunts are full of secrets. Hmm. I've never heard anyone else speak of it, and I've certainly never seen anyone else here. Again, mention this to no one, especially no Ollis. One. He has no love lost for his family or their secrets. But this place is special to him. Of course. Ominous spoke to me about his family when we first met. To say that he has no love lost for them is an understatement. Glad you understand. Anyway, the Undercroft has been a perfect place to sneak off to. Away from prying eyes. And even practice otherwise forbidden spells. Really? Uh-oh. Oh. Like the Blasting Curse. Blast! Professors say it's not an appropriate spell to teach students. A proper magical education ought to include all magic. My thoughts exactly. A spell like Confringo is only truly dangerous in untrained hands. Such spells should be properly taught, not banned. To be fair, I'm admittedly partial to more fiery forms of magic. But you should learn it. I can teach it to you safely here. What was it? It may take a while to get the feel for it. Mimic my wand movement. The incantation is Confringo. 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 You're getting it. So what is Ready it? to actually try it out? Stick to the targets, though. This one. Keep the Undercroft intact. Have a go at those candelabras. Both have their uses. Good for you. Nice work. How's it feel? It's a tad hot. You'll get used to it. I wonder. That's it. I think I've got it done. 
Okay. I have to say, I enjoyed that. The first time Ominous and I practiced Confringo, we singed our eyebrows. <laughs> I would have paid to see that. I swore we'd never live it down. So this day, there's something about that spell that's addictive. This is exactly the type of magic I've been hoping to learn. There's more where that came from. Been practicing similar spells here for ages. Although, I didn't tell Anne and Ominous about every one. Haven't been here in some time. It's not the same without Anne. I'm sorry about your sister. If there's anything I can do... Perhaps when I next head to Feldcroft, you could come along. Meet Anne. She could use some cheering up. What the hell happened to her? I forget. Just let me know when and I'll meet you. Oh, she misses Hogwarts. She's been stuck at home with our guardian, Uncle Solomon. Unfortunately, Solomon you'll have to meet him Grundy. too. Well, meeting a new student will be precisely what she needs. I shall look forward to it. Cheers. By the way, what was it you couldn't discuss out in the hall earlier? Oh, I'm not sure where to start. <clears throat> you said something was missing from what you found in the library. Might it have something to do with Victor Rookwood? He didn't mistake you for someone else at all in Hogsmeade, did he? Nothing gets past you. I'll tell you what I can. Rookwood and Ranrock are trying to recover something they think I took from a vault in Gringotts. Gringotts? When were you there? Professor Fig and I wound up there after the dragon attack. There was this port key that... A port key? To Gringotts? Well, it's all a bit convoluted. I'm listening. I don't exactly trust this guy yet. The book I found in the restricted section was missing some pages. That's about it. Pity. Didn't think you'd disappoint me with so vague an answer. I suppose with both Rookwood and Ranrock after you, a bit more time practicing the blasting curse is in order. Spend as much time here as you'd like. And remember, keep this place between us. Uh -huh. Got it. When I head to Feldcroft, I'll send you an owl. Okay, yeah, whatever. Alright. Huh, I wonder if that, uh... Ah, oh, of course, someone just standing there. Hello, Sebastian. Wait. You there! I can hear you! Oh, uh, hello, Ominous. I was just heading to our common room. I've recognized that voice. You're the new fifth year. Did you just come from the Undercroft? How did you get in there? That room's called the Undercroft. Ah, well, I was exploring and then suddenly found myself in a strange passageway. Don't lie to me. No one stumbles upon that room. Sebastian told you, didn't he? You breathe a word about this place to anyone. And not even your precious Professor Fig will be able to help you. My yeah, father you is there. friends with the headmaster. I am not afraid to exploit that connection if I need to. <laughs> you needn't threaten me. I'm threaten not going to say anything bitch. about your Undercroft. And Sebastian is a good friend. You shouldn't immediately assume the worst of him. I don't need you to tell me about my oldest friend. Thank you very much. Ominous, I just meant- I know what you meant. Sebastian gets himself in enough trouble. He doesn't need your help. Sebastian is going to get an earful about this. Yeah. Revelio. Oh. Well. Let's see here. Uh, if I went far enough away from him or not. <laughs> Rebellion. What was this thing? Oh. Damn it. Oops. It was uh, this one right here. Lumos. Well, where the hell are they? Where in the hell am I? 
It's all the smoke coming up off the floor. Off on another adventure, are we? Four seventeen fourteen. Oh, hey, look. Right here. Um. I forget. Lumos. There it is. Come on. Do do do. There you Has go. one person even tried to sort this dreadful odor? No. <laughs> In innocence, the brunt of jokes. Done. What the hell was that? Well, now the ship is far as past the nerves. You have a crop of men, well, something or another. She's still stinking. See something real quick, like huh. where was that? Uh... As we pull out the map, we'll see if this thing works on that. Uh... I think it was this one. <laughs> Flying around the school. No. Where was that one thing that I swam into yesterday? Hi. Alright, nah, uh, there it is. Couldn't bring that. I know what to do. Yep. Lumos. There we are. I know exactly what to do. Come on. Incendio. Got Lumos. There we go. Figured it out. Genius. Lumos. Come with me if you want to live. Genius. This murder Charles won't get the best of me. Uh, I think there's another one near here. Let's go ahead and check this one out. Do we go 
play around in that circle. In the forbidden forest. Huh. You know here stalking me. Can bring up. Oh yeah. Akio. Protego. Blue lights. Oh. Incendiary. Stupid one. Hey, don't try and crap on me. Can bring them. Cost. Incendiary. Get in fast. Right. Revelio. It's over there. Some somebody standing over there. Come how on forty of the beasts are safer now. Rebellion. These. What do you have in store? Oh, you want some? I mean, couldn't bring her. Oh. Couldn't bring her. Accio. Incendio. map here. 
care of it. Let me show you. I'm 100% positive I tried to go up there. up on my letter writing. Levioso! Revelio! Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley. Hmm. Somewhere away from prying eyes. Stopped me and I. Merlin's beard. 
I see you've wasted no time. Well done. Shall we? Off to you, Professor. What is this place? This is the rule of requirement. It only appears when one is in real need of it. Ordinarily, a student might stumble upon Revelio. it entirely by accident. If ever. I'd only planned to suggest to you how to find it by walking past that bit of wall, focusing on what you need. But you've managed to reveal the room on your own. While I'm here, we should take advantage of the moment. Now. Where is Deke? He must have sneaked past and gone ahead. Deke, Professor? The house elf I was speaking to in my classroom your first day. Thought he might help you use the room once you've found it. There's no chance I'm clambering over this mess. Hmm. Freaking this wizards. presents the perfect opportunity to teach you Evanesco, the vanishing Evanesco. spell. You can cast Evanesco to vanish certain objects, such as these chairs and other things here in the room. I suggest you practice the wand movements first, then you can clear the chairs away. Where do they go? Blended. Now. <coughs> uh, where the hell is it? There it is. Let's go on those chairs. Excellent work. You'll note that you are now in possession of Moonstone. We shall discuss its uses later. Let's move on. Revelio. Oh, a bit of it. What does it do? I need to know now. Where in Merlin's name is that elf? So I'm going on over here. Is that goodness? Uh, My old for you, school for bag. Perhaps you were assigned a few more. Where that had got to. Just a parchment, though. I can't believe it's still here. I'll just take a quick look at this. Give you an opportunity to explore on your own until we locate Deke. Yes, Professor. Revelio. Oh, dear me. Can't you keep it down? Some of us are trying to rest. Hmm. Huh. Even here. Wonder, wonder, wonder. Akio. <laughs> That didn't work. Uh, Whee! Uh, Can bring up Akio. There we are. Revelio. I hope this isn't as precarious as it looks. How big is this thing? Stop the Revelio. No, not uh, that's not helpful, you worthless pilot <laughs> <laughs> Entered the room, thought I needed a bath. Huh. Ah, thank you. Revelio. Hmm. <clears throat> How 
How does anyone other than a house elf manage to get around in here? What was that? That's a uh Was I that a it? golden switch? No. Perhaps you should summon your wits and find out. <laughs> Where is he at? Hello, Mr. Wizard. Revelio. Catch it. I hope that house elf can find us in here. It's a broom. Rebellion. Rebellion. Really want that chest though. You just see something here. Hmm. Akio. will come to you. <coughs> Hello. Ah, oh, Deke. We've been looking for you. Uh, apologies, Professor Weasley. Deke was looking through some of what's appeared in the room since Deke was last here. Is this the student? Indeed it is. Deke is honored to meet you. Deke yeah, has been a up, friend man? since I was a second year. We discovered this room together. I mentioned you to Deke. We believe that you might be able to benefit from this room like I did. Deke, would you be so kind? Of course, Professor Weasley. 
The Room of Requirement will always be equipped for the Seeker's needs. It's unplottable, so won't appear on any map. Most happen upon it by accident, if ever. Deep-seen students in need of an extra file for potions stumble upon the room filled with them. <laughs> you seem to have accessed it in its form as the Room of Hidden Things. I was thinking about needing a place away from prying eyes. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, that explains it then. What I need specifically is a place where I can catch up on my schoolwork without distraction. Well then, the room can provide you with precisely that. Now, it's time to focus on what you need. Just close your eyes. Imagine the room precisely as you need it. The room will do the rest. what you do with the space. Ah, and it seems the room has provided you with a desk of description. Excellent. It can identify unfamiliar items of clothing. One should always understand the effects of anything in which one is clothed. Well, like the desk of description. You'll find plenty of items of clothing that need to be identified. The desk will be an invaluable resource. Okay. What is all this? What's going on here? Revelio. I'm gonna get this kicked off. Hello? Oh, you don't have any smart ass comments right now? I imagine the desk of description will come in handy. It will. I hope you'll take advantage of it. Now, I'll give you a brief lesson in conjuring. The room might not provide everything you need on its own. Conjuring? Yes, the magic of creating or conjuring objects. I'll teach you. Nice. Boom! Lock all these spells. Very good. When conjuring more complex objects, you'll need what's called a spellcraft. Spellcrafts spell are like recipes. They list the ingredients or resources ah, needed to conjure a particular stones. object. You should have acquired some for a potion station and potting table from tomes and scrolls in Hogsmeade. I did. Where can I find the resources I need? While resources such as Moonstone can be obtained throughout the Highlands, it's much <coughs> safer and easier to purchase them. They can also be collected by vanishing objects in the room, such as the chairs you vanished earlier. In fact, you should have enough resources for now. I see. <laughs> can I regain resources by vanishing something I've already conjured? You can indeed. Hmm. Quite perceptive. Why don't you give it a try? Go ahead and conjure the potion station and potting table. You should find both familiar since they'll resemble the ones you've already used to study magical plots and brew potions in class. <laughs> oh, oh, what the hell? Conjuring. All right. Biology. All hangings. Artwork. 
decorations, furniture, rugs, seating, tables, statues, seasonal decorations. Whenever you need to brew potions or grow plants. Presuming, of course, you've collected any seeds or potion hmm. ingredients you need in Hogsmeade or outside the castle grounds. Deke will be here to answer any questions you may have. Do not underestimate his insights. Got it. Can I use this type of transfiguration magic outside of the room? Conjuring and vanishing are strictly forbidden elsewhere in the castle. We've charms in place to enforce that. Hmm. It would be exhausting to reverse the errors in both judgment and magic. But the room of requirement has its own rules. Can you tell me a bit more hmm. about Deke? He's yeah, been he's at Hogwarts longer than I have and seems to know it's every nook, cranny and secret. We discovered this room together when I was a student. Deke has had a good deal of experience, both here at Hogwarts and at a previous post. I shall let Deke tell you more when he's ready, but again, you would be wise to listen to any suggestions he may have. I will be sure to speak with Deke if I need anything. Thank you. Good luck. I shall linger a bit longer in case you'd like to learn another transfiguration spell for use in the room. <coughs> I'm ready for the next lesson, Professor. Very well. First, you'll need to gather some Moonstone. You Done. can acquire it by vanishing items here in the Room of Requirement, or you can gather it carefully outside of the Hogwarts grounds. Return to me once you've gathered enough, and we shall begin the lesson. Okay, come on. Seriously. the moonstone you requested professor good then we may begin your lesson you can conjure more than potions and herbology tables conjuration can be used to decorate this space to your liking why don't you try it on the walls and floor i would like to teach you wingardium leviosa it can be used to levitate objects for a short time once you've completed a few prerequisite tasks, do you see me after class? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. You want to teach me something I already know? Mm -hmm. Alright, so... Conjure wall decorations. Yeah, I want to see what this is. 
I already got that. Chanted. <laughs> I got that. seen this many plants here before. Deke thinks you should be proud of all the potions you've brewed. conjured everything I can. What's next, Professor? I think you're ready to take on alteration. The altering spell will allow you to customize any conjured item. You can change the colors, patterns, and styles of your furniture to suit your taste. Let's get started, shall we? Watch closely as I demonstrate how to perform the altering spell. at any conjured item and perform the altering spell. Lumos. This is Ringardium, right? Oh. Okay. <laughs> Dee cannot believe how many beasts you have here. Incendium. Oh, oops. I didn't do that. Hasn't seen this many plants here before. Change the color? 
nicely done. Now you're ready for something a little more advanced. You can use the altering spell directly on the room's architecture. Try these new designs on the floor or balcony. Your space might benefit from a bit of ambiance, don't you think? Deke, would you mind? Of course, Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley showed Deke this bit of magic some years ago. Deke thinks you'll enjoy it. Uh, come and talk to Deke when you're ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Professor Weasley said I should ask you about changing the room's ambience? Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? I would like the room to feel as if it's being lit by the moon. Hmm, oh, sounds perfect. That looks all right. I've changed some other things. <laughs> Get rid mm. of the drugs. Quite a difference. Of course, you needn't keep this style if you don't like it. You can always ask Deke to change it back. Now you have learned a good bit about alteration. Thank you, Professor. The room is full of possibilities. Indeed. No matter how much time I spend here, the room always manages to surprise me. All right. itself to your needs. It must have sensed that you needed more space to practice spell casting. If you'd like to customize the space further, you can use these spellcrafts. You'll find more of them both inside and outside the school. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep an eye out. Good. I'll leave you to it. This is your space now. Use it wisely. I'll probably move my bed in here. I'm not sleeping. So... Check what he wants. Real quick. I'd like to ask you about changing the room's ambience. Uh, of course. Uh, what sort of overall uh, look most does. appeals to you? Hmm. Actually, perhaps another time. Yeah. All right. Let's um. Thank you. 
Really? Must be grown in large pots. Sell all those now. Face whale. Well. Uh, I can't even want to handle that. How many damn brooms can I get? Wait a minute. Alright, so I think we're gonna. Deke cannot believe how many beasts you have here. Deke hasn't seen this many plants here before. Alright, we're gonna stop this for now, but thank you all for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe. And I'll catch you all in the next one. Peace!